Pratap Naidu. Yeah. So good evening, everyone. So thank you very much for the introduction. So at the outset, I would like to thank organizers, uh, Thangrasa, for providing me the opportunity. So today, we would like to focus mostly um, on the ion torrent gen access system, which is the first specimen to report uh, turnkey next generation sequencing system that is available uh, in the market. So this is uh, the small cartoon about the Thermo Fisher Scientific. I'm sure some of you or many of you may have one or multiple products of Thermo Fisher Scientific running your lab. So Thermo Fisher Scientific has so many exceptional brands, including Applied Biosystems, which is synonymous with the Sanger sequencing. We have Invitrogen, and Iron Torrent is one of our exceptional brands. Um, you know, the, the product that I'm going to talk is about primarily on the Iron Torrent um, GenXX system. So for the you know past several years, for the past around eight years, so there has been a lot of focus on the targeted sequencing. You know, people are more interested in the targeted sequencing, be it as an oncology or a reproductive health. So the ion torrent is pioneered with the um, you know with the targeted sequencing, which we call it as an AmpliSeq technology, where you can able to you know um, you know simply synthesize several primer pools and you can able to amplify using a simple PCR approach and you can able to sequence it by using ion torrent you know series of instruments we have gene studio s5 and then you know you can able to uh, perform the analysis using cloud based ion reporter software or uh, standalone uh, ion reporter software as well so the beauty of this system is that it's very simple you can able to read two human exomes in two and a half hours of time it is a scalable if you want to do a microbiome or if you want to do a bacterial sequencing or a total rna sequencing it's quite scalable um, in, in terms of the um, you know data output uh, because we have a different kinds of uh, semiconductor chips that are available so so if you look at the different challenges that the next generation sequencing market especially when you look at the clinical research so the main challenge that that, that we see is that it requires sometimes you know days and um, you know in some cases you would require some weeks to get the results it would also require high level of expertise for library preparation and of course for hiring the staff you know the required staff which is again a burden to the lab and of course there is always challenges with respect to the amount of the nucleic acid that is available so taking into the consideration of these challenges so what we have come up we have come up with a new revolutionary next generation sequencing system with just two um, you know two user touch points you know uh, this is what we call it as a ion uh, gen access system which is the first tourniquet system where the library preparation the data generation up to the variant reporting is completely automated and we also have um, you know the nucleic acid purification system from specimen so you can put the specimen here you isolate the nucleic acid followed by the purification and quantification then you know you put the um, you know the starting genetic material and you finally in 14 hours of time you end up with a um, you know with a variant calling report so this is this is this is the level of uh, revolution that the ion torrent with the gen access system that is um, you know put forward the system was launched in the month of the november where you can able to process in a single day with a turnaround time of close to 14 hours. It's completely automated with just two user touch points, which will completely remove the, um, you know, the skilled uh, expertise that are required for library prep which means that you know there will be minimal errors and this is a flexibility where you can able to run from single sample to multiple samples uh, in a days of time and uh, you know at the moment it is for the clinical research applications that includes uh, oncology and also uh, with the uh, many inherited diseases including the reproductive health so this is this is a cartoon that talks about the you know the different touch points that are available with respect to the various workflows and the different kinds of the uh, next generation sequencing systems if you see the gene studio s5 that's from the ion torrent we have several touch points uh, at the lab, um, you know the isolation of the nucleic acid quantification then template prep sequencing and of course the um, you know the reporting um, uh, the points so if you look at there are several other systems where the touch points may go up to 10 different touch points and also there might be a provision um, you know the uh, you know you would require skill expertise to perform all these steps so to overcome all these things see the ion torrent has launched these uh, um, you know the gen access systems where with a less than two touch points within 14 hours of time you can able to um, you know isolate the nucleic acid and then uh, go to the um, you know uh, to the variant calling reporter 
So these are the different kinds of the sample types that we um, initially support uh, from FFE, tissue, saliva, and so on. Uh, within two hours of turnaround time, you can able to purify the nucleic acid and you can able to quantify it as well. And then uh, you can take it to the next system, the Genexus system, where you can simply prepare automated library prep followed by the sequencing using semiconductor sequencing technology. So the principle um, you know uh, is the same like our previous semiconductor sequencing technology where we flow the uh, the DNTPs in the sequential order and if there is a match with the um, with the complementary base there will be a hydrogen ion is released and the uh, the semiconductor chip uh, that is present will be capable of uh, detecting the change in the hydrogen ion concent uh, concentration which will be detected in the form of a base so so and this is this is the beauty of the semiconductor chip is that so we divided this chip into several lanes you know and each lane will generate up to 15 million uh, reads and so if you are not interested to use all the lanes the chip can be stored back up to two weeks of time and you can very well use it uh, within two weeks of time so 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 we, this this reduces the you know the cost of the reaction dramatically uh, far lower than what is present uh, in the market and within 14 hours um, you know you can able to complete the uh, the single run and you can able to multiplex up to 32 samples uh, per run using the uh, the gen access system so so you can perform up to four different assays and you can able to multiplex if it is a single pool you go up to 32 and of course it's a uh, two pools you can go up to 16 sample and the reagents arm you know that we use it uh, the stability of these reagents is two weeks on instrument uh, along with the reagent stability as well and of course these are uh, very uh, completely filled with the RFID tagging and you can able to track these uh, usage of these reagents so uh, this is a fully the first fully integrated uh, next generation sequencer that is available in the market and needless to mention this is one of the best easy to use the system and it has uh, you know highly robust variant calling algorithm that has been used in our ion reporter and it's of course it's uh, quite flexible um, uh, with respect to the different kinds of assays that you can able to um, utilize it so at the moment we have several fixed panels that the system has been validated so we use the custom ampliseq hd panels you can also use the ampliseq as well as on demand panels that are available on our ampliseq.com website and at the moment uh, this was with the uh, validated with the oncomine precision assay as well as the comprehensive assay and also tcr beta but as, as I said at the moment, the focus is on the clinical research with respect to these fixed assays, but there is also a provision that it can also move to the reproductive health, different kinds of panels that are, um, uh, you know, that are quite popular uh, with respect to the AmpliSeq domain. Okay, so, so we, we want to focus this system uh, uh, exclusively for the clinical research for the oncology as well as for the, uh, you know, the reproductive health and another inherited disease targeting on the AmpliSeq targeted sequencing approach. But people who are interested uh, uh, in microbial research, non-invasive prenatal testing, PGS, and other kinds of the clinical research applications, people can very well use our existing Gene Studio S5 system where we can able to generate 50 gigs of data uh, um, um, in, in a single initialization and we also have a separate um, you know automation what we call it as an iron chef the name indicates that it's going to prepare everything for you including from library prep uh, to the sequencing so my talk is primarily focusing on the instrument not on the uh, on the applications because this was uh, just launched uh, uh, in the month of the November so this is this is a uh, you know this is a very comprehensive uh, there are quite a lot of numbers are there but what I wanted to focus is that you know um, you can see the 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 name of the assay and the number of the samples that you can able to uh, you know you can able to multiplex you can go up to from a single sample to 30 samples 32 samples depending upon the number of reads that are uh, required for each specific assay. So the, so the reagents for the gen access systems comes in a strips where you, you can able to track uh, both for the library prep and as well as for the, um, you know, the template prep and also for the sequencing. And so which will be uh, very easy to identify depending on the assay that you plan or intend to use it. 
So these are this is the, this points about the um, the wash bottles that have been used uh, for maintaining the um, you know the pH inside and also for uh, you know the washing the uh, DNTPs when the flow is over. And this is a um, the cartridge uh, that has been there used for. Yeah, two more minutes, Prata. Yeah. So uh, the upright biosystems is known for um, you know a great support across India. So we have several uh, field service and support employees who uh, help the researchers to perform the experiments and so on. Okay. So the next uh, one minute. So in addition to the Genexis system, what we have it, we uh, Affymetrix is also a part of Thermo Fisher Scientific, where we have a microarray instruments like Gene Titan and GCS 3000 as well. So with this, we have um, you know we collaborated recently with the Finnish, where we have um, you know 650k uh, chip, where you can able to do the whole genome uh, genotyping as well. Okay. So with these applications, you can able to target several kinds of uh, markers with respect to ancestry or the traits, or if you are um, you know, planning for a screening for diagnostics, you can also use it, several markers using the Gene Titan microarray instruments. So with this, uh, I pass myself, uh, and I would be happy to take any questions. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah.